Hello to everybody, how are you this morning? I hope you are doing fantastic. I want to show you this short video uh, in order to show you the way I plan is, uh, to solve a severe rotation than this one that I have in the 13 in this upper right canine that also is associated with this huge inclination to missile to the crown. Okay, so a mistake that normally is done in cases like this is trying to solve from the beginning the rotation and also the tipping of the cannon. We have to sequence, sequence uh, this movement and the way to do it in this case is going to be that I'm going to use the power and the, and the, the push of the expansion to rotate distal out the canine okay but with no modification in the tipping okay and when this tall out is solved what i'm going to do is messial in and with this messial in movement is when i'm going to solve the tipping okay so don't try to solve the tipping from the beginning because you don't have the space well we have a small space right here but it's not enough so the idea is first expand and distal out rotation. When distal out is solved, then mesialine. And in that moment when we are doing mesialine is when we solve the, um, the tipping. Look at the way I'm doing. I'm expanding distal out, distal out, distal out, distal out, distal out. Okay, look at here. As you can see here, I'm rotating this tall out, this tall out, but the, I'm not modifying the tipping, as you can see. Once again, this tall out, this tall out, expansion, this tall out, this tall out. Okay, now when this tall out is solved or almost solved, it will be here. In this moment is when we are going to do mesial in and distal crown tip at the same time. And you see? Okay. So is this tall out? No modification in the tipping. And then messial in and distal crown tip. Okay. So doing that, the rotation movement is going to be predictable. We are going to be able to solve this case. Okay. Fantastic.